Harrison was born 16th of September. Once the diagnosis of X-linked myotubular myopathy was delivered, uh, a lot of things kind of fell into place. It's a strange experience having a child in the hospital when you're learning to be a parent and you know asking permission to pick up your child. The first time coming here in November, I think I kind of shocked myself because as soon as I arrived, I just started crying. There was a sense of really the pressure valve and you know kind of been lifted you know we were just craving a family experience so Laura Lynn was the first time that we had been able to experience that we didn't want to leave his side they had a cot by our bed where he could sleep next to us and we slept sideways so our heads were both at Harrison so in the middle of the night for the first time we can wake up and look over and see where he was I remember the first time yes. changing an nappy at 4 a.m in the morning I had the biggest smile on my face <laughs> you can tell Laura Lynn is about enjoying life every day in many ways Going home, not going home in, in December was heartbreaking and earth shattering and world shattering, but the last few months have sort of, I guess, paid us back for having had go through that experience. We know that Laura Lynn will forever have a special place in our heart. You know, this, this time, we can't thank them enough for this time because, you know, it, it is just being a family that's all we've wanted yeah. and they've given that to us.